Welcome to Car Seat Blog's sneak peek at the new Britax Marathon 70. It just arrived on my doorstep a few minutes ago and I was over the moon to say the least. Um, this is going to be a very quick video review and I will post more information when I return from 4th of July weekend on Monday. Let's take a quick look at what we have here. First up, the crimson fabric is a lovely soft plush almost corduroy like nubby fabric. Very nice. Some differences that will be pretty obvious almost immediately is first we have EPP foam instead of EPS foam which is a little bit more durable and less likely to crack. You'll notice that the lock-offs are now integrated into the base. The harness adjuster mechanism is very different Basically, there is still a lever there, and you raise it up to tighten, I'm sorry, to loosen the harness. There you have the other lock off. We have two, two positions now for the crotch strap buckle, which is going to be nice. Here we see the integrated forward-facing lock offs. Very nice, and they're recessed, so your child should not feel that at all. All right, let's see. The base, you can see the latch bars are different. The base now has rubber, almost grippy-like material down at the bottom. Forgive me. Okay, we have nice little recessed areas here to store our lower latch connectors and obviously they're still the nice safeguard type. Splitter plate has changed. It's now a single arm type splitter plate and the harness adjuster mechanism is almost like the Frontier where it slides up and down on a track and I'm going to put this camera down for a second while I attempt to raise it up. Okay, this is our tallest harness height position and we'll, you can see that the headrest extends quite a few inches above the top of the shell. And this is what it looks like from the front when it's fully extended. By comparison, here is a decathlon. You can see that the overall height of the Marathon 70 um, has increased quite a bit by that adjustable head restraint. However, I did a quick measurement and it, it appears that the top harness slots are similar between both models. You, I'm getting about 17 inches um, for the new Marathon 70, so I honestly don't think that it's going to buy you any more growing room height-wise than the original Decathlon, Marathon, or Boulevard will. Let me see, what else? Oh, I did lower it all the way to the bottom position and I tried a newborn doll in it and the straps were still a good three inches above the top of the baby's shoulders. There is supposed to be an infant insert that you can purchase separately from Britax. I do not have that um, and so I cannot comment on how much that will change the fit for a newborn. For now, that's it from carseatblog.com. Happy 4th of July weekend, and I promise more Marathon 70 review stuff to come on Monday. Cheerio!